Why we care what others think of us? Because it's natural to care about what others think of us. This feeling goes back to our ancestors who needed to stick together for survival. Today, we still have that deep-seated need to be accepted, and the fear of rejection can cause us a lot of anxiety. This fear can lead us to do things we don't really want to do just to fit in. It's all connected to the physical part of our brain that controls our survival instincts. So, you can see why so many of us constantly fight our fear of what others think of us. We are only human. The good news is that we can change the way our brains react. By recognizing what triggers our natural survival instinct, we can start to change the way we respond. We should avoid judging ourselves so harshly for feeling a certain way, instead, we should be curious and gentle with ourselves. This takes practice, but over time we can train our brains to be less reactive and more proactive. Neuroscientists have discovered that our brains are malleable. In fact, there is a term for this. Neuroplasticity is the term used to describe our brain's ability to form new connections and neural pathways by changing our reactions to everyday situations. How? By noticing what people, words, and situations trigger us in negative ways. What makes you feel unworthy? What makes you respond to going along with the crowd even when you don't want to? Try to become aware of your emotional responses. But instead of judging the emotion perhaps thinking, I shouldn't feel this way. I should be grateful I have this job, just notice it with curiosity. With practice, you could be amazed at your progress. So, just by noticing our triggers and becoming aware of our emotional responses, we can start to shift our entire way of thinking. It's a journey, but it's a worthwhile one. Self-knowledge is powerful. Thanks for listening.